St. Bernard's are loving, placid dogs. Their instinctive friendliness is likely to offset a stranger's initial fear of approaching such a large dog. However, St. Bernard's are equally quick to protect family members who they believe are in danger. Because they are so friendly, gentle, and tolerant, saints can especially be good for families with well-behaved children. Known to be exceptionally understanding and patient, saints are careful not to injure a child. These dogs are eager to please, which can make training easier than with other breeds. Today in this video, we will discuss about the St. Bernard's, fierce or friendly. Let's jump on it. What's the origin of a St. Bernard? Let's dig into a bit of history. The St. Bernard is lovingly named after Monk Bernard of Menton, a kind-hearted soul who lived around 1020. Bernard of Menton established the Great St. Bernard Hospice for pilgrims traversing the snowy Swiss Alps via the Great St. Bernard Pass on their way to Rome. In later years, the monks enlisted the dogs to help guard passers-by and the fearless pups are also credited with saving lost travelers in treacherous mountain avalanches and snowdrifts. St. Bernard's have a keen sense of smell and pathfinding abilities. The dog's mild temperament, attentiveness and kindness earned them the nickname Hospice Dogs. St. Bernard's are very large, powerful, muscular dogs. A male's St. Bernard's height can range between 28 and 30 inches and he can weigh between 140 and 180 pounds. A female's height may range between 26 and 28 inches and she may weigh between 120 and 140 pounds. The dogs are so large, they take longer than many of the other breeds to mature fully. They generally do not reach their full size until they are 2 or 3 years old. They nearly became extinct. Between 1816 and 1818, the winter snowstorms at St. Bernard Pass were particularly severe and many dogs died in avalanches while doing rescue work. As a result, the St. Bernard breed living at the hospice came close to extinction. However, the breed was replenished two years later with similar animals from nearby valleys. They were used to rescue work. The St. Bernard is a breed of very large working dog from the Western Alps in Italy and Switzerland. They were originally bred for rescue work by the hospice of the Great St. Bernard Pass on the Italian-Swiss border. Predisposed to health maladies The very fast growth rate and the weight of a St. Bernard can lead to a very serious deterioration of the bones if the dog does not get proper food and exercise. Many dogs are genetically affected by the hip dysplasia or elbow dysplasia. Osteosarcoma has been shown to be hereditary in the breed. They are susceptible to eye disorders called entropion and ectropion, in which the eyelid turns in or out. The breed standard indicates that this is a major fault. The breed is also susceptible to epilepsy and seizures, a heart disease called dilated cardiomyopathy and eczema. They make terrible guard dogs. St. Bernard's do make good guard dogs and can be very protective due to their inherent traits and characteristics. This breed is intelligent, strong, vigilant, and extremely loyal to their family, all of which help make a good guard dog. St. Bernard originates from the Great St. Bernard Hospice. The name St. Bernard originates from the Great St. Bernard Hospice, a traveler's hospice on the often treacherous Great St. Bernard Pass in the Western Alps, between Switzerland and Italy. The pass, the lodge, and the dogs are named for Bernard of Menton, the 11th century Italian monk who established the station. St. Bernard Day, not in widespread use until the middle of the 19th century. The dogs were called Saint Dogs, Noble Steeds, or Barry Dogs before that time. Finally, are St. Bernard's fierce or friendly? They are so friendly, gentle, and tolerant, saints can be especially good for families with well-behaved children. Known to be exceptionally understanding and patient, saints are careful not to injure a child. If I missed any information, let me know by commenting below. Thanks for watching this video. You are invited to watch more videos and subscribe to our channel for more updates. Thank you.